Hello and welcome to a new video about measurement. We're still talking about flow measurement, but this is the last flow measurement promised. Huh? At least the last flow measurement we're talking about. We're talking about the careerless flow measurement. It's a very unique method yeah, and I hope I can explain it in a way that you can understand. Coriolis flow measurement uh, is based on the Coriolis forces. So how is this working? Yeah? So inside such flow meter there is usually a tube which is looks like that. Maybe a little bit too extreme, yeah? but it's something elastic, so it's not really a hose, but it is elastic. Here are the connectors, all right? So here we have flow from this side to this side. And we want to determine which, how much flow there is. Yeah? If I'm looking, let's make this more technical. Yeah? If I'm projecting this from the top, it would look like that. Huh? And the thing is now, here, this, this hose tube thing, yeah, this is always pushed a little. Tick, tick, tick. So this is actually swinging. Yeah, like that. Zit, zit, zit. Or here. Up, down. Swinging up and down. Uh, here up and down, but it's left, right, actually. Yeah. So we are actually swinging here like that. Yeah. In one direction. and in the other direction. This is swinging. And this is how the swing looks like without, without water flow, okay? Without water flow. Here we have two sensors. One on this side, one on this side, yeah. sensors. They are located here somewhere. Yeah. These are the sensors. And those sensors to detect the swinging. Okay, so those two, every time that the hose, the tube is getting close, the sensor will give a signal. So it will always pip. And both sensors have the same signal eh? because they are symmetrically at the tube located. So they have the same signal. Whenever the hose is getting close, doot, both sensors will give a signal. Okay. What is if we have now water flow? Eh? Flow. Hmm. This water flow is disturbing the swinging because it has a movement of inertia. Yeah? It's a flow which has a movement of inertia and the flow does not like to change this movement of inertia. Yeah? However, it is swinging. So actually what is happening is that this is swinging is not symmetrical. Yeah? It's not swinging like that. It's swinging, it starts to swing like... Okay? Because the flow is now rushing in here and wants to straighten out, but cannot, and so it will slow down and it will not symmetrically swing, but it swings like that. And this effect is stronger the more, actually, it's mass I'm measuring, mass flow, the more mass flow there is. All right? And if I know the density, then I know exactly how much cubic centimeters or whatever pass are passing. So with flow, we do have the situation that this looks a little bit like it's wobbling. 
Ja? It's not swinging straight, it's wobbling. The swing is disturbed. This, this is swinging with water or what I have. It's not really water, yeah. Fluid. It needs to flow, okay? It it can be a gas, it can be water, it can be whatever you like, yeah. It can even be dirty inside and so on. How, the mass, the mass, the movement of inertia of this mass is forcing this to wobble. Yeah? And if we now look at the sensors and we are whoop, beep, 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 we do have a shift yeah, in the signals, and this timely shift in the signals. Yeah, is indicating how much disturbance there is in our smooth swinging, yeah? and this is indicating how much mass flow there currently is. Right? So, <laughs> isn't that? This is the principle of Coriolis flow measurement. There is for sure a lot of details to be thought of, yeah, if you really want to produce such sensor, but there are companies which can do that very well. Right? Coriolis flow measurement. Last flow measurement. Yeah? Quite sophisticated. I hope I could explain the principle. Next things we're talking about is, is a pressure measurement. Okay? Last big measurement, physical quantity we want to measure, that's the pressure. Yeah? Temperature, flow, force, pressure, length, these are the main things. One is missing, pressure. Next time, next video, pressure measurement. For this time, thank you very much for listening. Goodbye.